Safety and performance, that's what it's all about during cataract surgery. Here at Erdly, of course, we focus on safety and performance, and that's why we have a new feature in the OS4, which I and I would like to show you. The occlusion mode for the OS4 is available for all three FACO modes. In this example, I will show it to you with the FACO mode 2. Here we start with the default values and this is how the device looks like when you apply the new software and you want to start up the FACO mode. So here you don't see any hint for the occlusion mode, we need to activate it first. To do so, we open the AUX menu and here we now see with the new software occlusion mode. The occlusion mode, very important to know, is available only with the peristaltic pump system. So if I want to use it, I have to choose for the peristaltic pump system and then open the AUX menu again. By doing so, I now see that I can configure the values for the occlusion mode. Important to know is that the trigger for the occlusion mode is the vacuum. The vacuum for the occlusion mode needs to be lower than the maximum vacuum. Here in this example, I now go for, let's say, 200 millimeters of mercury. The occlusion mode as such, as said in the intro, um, is something which should increase the safety and the performance of the cataract surgery. So to increase the safety and to avoid that FACO power is applied into the eye unwanted, we can lower the FACO power for the main values, for example here down to 20%, and I keep it up to 50%, and now if I save these values, as soon as the occlusion mode gets active, I can operate with 50% of FACO power. If it's not active, I will stay in the lower power region with 20%. Now I have saved all the values. I can close the AUX menu. And now this button occlusion mode appears on the display. Um, I need to press this button to activate and to deactivate the occlusion mode. Um, if I now have it deactivated, step on the pedal, irrigate and aspirate. Now I'm simulating an um, occlusion. You can see that um, all the main values apply and I can apply FACO power even if there won't be any occlusion, meaning if there won't be any lens fragment in front of the tip. Now I activate the occlusion mode and I do the same again. I also simulate here an occlusion. The vacuum grows and now what you can see here is as soon as I pass the trigger the FACO power and the flow turn to green and now these are the values which I just configured for the occlusion mode and now I can apply as soon as there is an occlusion 50% of FACO power until the occlusion is removed. Then I can also, if I want to have it, deactivate the occlusion mode and continue operating with the main values. That's basically the occlusion mode. Why should you use it? It's a kind of safety feature. Um, you can decrease FACO power for your main values. This is the support mainly for people which are possibly new with the OS4, which need to get used to the new pedal with its defined positions. Um, it helps to increase the performance of the cataract surgery and that's why we applied it here on the OS4 with the new software. Thank you.